are the top 5 biggest freshwater fish in the world. Number 5. Alligator Gar The alligator gar is a ray fendi Aurelian fish related to the bowfin in the Infraglass Holistae. It is the largest species in the gar family and among the largest freshwater fishes in North America. The fossil record traces its group's existence back to the early Cretaceous over 100 million years ago. Gars are often referred to as primitive fishes, or living fossils because they have retained some morphological characteristics of their earliest ancestors, such as a spiral valve intestine, which is also common to the digestive system of sharks and the ability to breathe both air and water. Their common name was derived from their resemblance to the American alligator, particularly their broad snouts and long, sharp teeth. Anecdotal evidence suggests that an alligator gar can grow up to 10 feet, 3.0 meters, in length. These freshwater giants may look fierce, but attacks against people are unknown. They can pose a passive danger, though the fish's eggs are poisonous to humans if ingested. Adult gars have few natural predators, Although alligators have been known to attack them, young are preyed upon by larger fish. Alligator gars prey on fish, but they are opportunistic and have been known to feed on everything from waterfowl and small turtles to carrion. Gars inhabit lakes, bayous, and bays and are able to tolerate brackish and even salt water. But these toothy giants prefer large, slow-moving rivers, particularly those with wide flood lanes where shallow waters provide hatchlings with some protection from predators. Though an alligator gar will go berserk if threatened and can definitely seem dangerous, there has never been a verified attack on a human by an alligator gar, even though they do have needle-sharp teeth. Number 4. Mekong Giant Catfish The Mekong Giant Catfish is a species of catfish in the shark catfish family. It is gray to white in color and is distinguished by the near total lack of barbels and the absence of teeth. The world's largest scaleless freshwater fish lives a tenuous existence in the murky brown waters of Southeast Asia's Mekong River. Capable of reaching an almost mythical 10 feet, 3 meters, in length and 650 pounds, 295 kilograms, Mekong giant catfish live mainly in the lower half of the Mekong River system, in Cambodia, Laos, Thailand, and Vietnam. Mekong giant catfish have very low set eyes and are silvery to dark gray on top and whitish to yellow on the bottom. They are toothless herbivores who live off the plant and algae in the river. Juveniles wear the characteristic catfish whiskers, called barbels, but these features shrink as they age. Highly migratory creatures, Giant catfish require large stretches of river for their seasonal journeys and specific environmental conditions in their spawning and breeding areas. They are thought to rear primarily in Cambodia's Tonal Sap Lake and migrate hundreds of miles north to spawning grounds in Thailand. Dams and human encroachment, however, have severely disrupted their life cycle. Once plentiful throughout the Mekong Basin, population numbers have dropped by some 95% over the past century and this critically endangered behemoth now teeters on the brink of extinction. Overfishing is the primary culprit in the giant catfish's decline, the damming of Mekong tributaries, destruction of spawning and breeding grounds, and siltation have taken a huge toll. Some experts think there may only be a few hundred adults left. Number 3. Giant Freshwater Stingray At half the length of a bus the gargantuan freshwater stingray may be the largest fish swimming in freshwater on Earth today. At more than half a ton in size, large stingrays have been known to pull boats up and down rivers and even underwater. The giant stingray is one of the world's largest freshwater fish, but it's also cloaked in mystery. No one is sure how many giant stingrays are left, which habitats they prefer, or even if they ever venture into the ocean, where their more commonly known relatives dwell. These ancient fish, little changed over many millions of years, can reach 16.5 feet long and weigh up to 1,320 pounds. They are brown to gray in color, white and flat in form, and they sport a long, whip-like tail. Giant stingrays are known to prowl river systems in Thailand, Borneo, New Guinea, and northern Australia. They often bury themselves in sandy or silted river bottoms and breathe through holes, or spiracles, located on top of their bodies. Stingrays locate prey, usually clams and crabs with a sensor that can detect an animal's electrical field. Though stingrays do not readily attack humans, they are one of the few mega fishes that can pose a real danger to those who handle them. Each ray sports a deadly barb on the base of its tail that can easily penetrate human skin and even bone, much like a hunting arrow. The stinger can be as long as 15 inches and typically introduces toxins to the victim's wound.
Number 2. White Sturgeon. White Sturgeon is distinguished by the two rows of 4 to 8 ganoid bony plates between the anus and anal fin, with about 45 rays present in the dorsal fin. Coloring can range from gray to brownish on the dorsal side, paler on the ventral side, and gray fins. Barbels are situated anterior to the mouth, closer to the snout than the mouth. At sexual maturity, white sturgeon can reach 5.2 feet in length, while the maximum length recorded of any age class is 20 feet with common lengths around 6.9 feet. While age at maturity is uncertain, possible age ranges of known white sturgeon specimens range from 11 to 34 years old. The maximum published weight known was 816 kilograms with a reported age of 104 years. White sturgeon are native to several large North American rivers that drain to the Pacific Ocean. They primarily live in estuaries of large rivers, but migrate to spawn in fresh water and travel long distances between river systems. Reproducing populations have been documented along the west coast, from northern Mexico up to the Aleutian Islands in Alaska. White sturgeon are commonly found in deep, soft-bottomed areas of estuaries, where movements in the water column is dependent on salinity. Historical ranges have been modified substantially by overharvesting, habitat changes due to dams, and river regulations, all affecting habitat quality suitability and connectivity. White sturgeon are a resource to a variety of different social and economic groups around the world. Aquaculture facilities cultivate white sturgeon in California and juveniles can be sold to aquarists. They were once the main food source for First Nations people in the 1800s, until overfishing by commercial fleets for caviar drove them to near extinction by the early 1900s. Number 1. Beluga Sturgeon the largest freshwater fish in the world is the beluga sturgeon of Russia, according to the U.S. Geological Survey. These giants can grow to 15 feet long, 4.5 meters, and weigh 2,500 pounds, 1,133 kilograms, according to the Natural Resources Defense Council. Beluga sturgeon are prized for their eggs, which are sold as caviar. Populations have shrunk dramatically due to high demand for the gourmet treat and the species has been listed as endangered since 2004. The beluga sturgeon is one of the only species of sturgeons that actively eats other fishes and is one of the largest predatory fishes on Earth. Adult beluga sturgeon have few natural predators, but fishing pressure by people has been very high. The beluga sturgeon is, unfortunately, cursed with producing some of the most desirable caviar in the world. Caviar is the table name for fish eggs and beluga sturgeon produce millions of eggs. Large individuals have been known to carry several hundred pounds of caviar, and beluga sturgeon caviar can be worth as much as 8,000 US dollars per kilo. This incredible value combined with the amount of eggs that a single beluga sturgeon can produce makes this species the most valuable fish in the world to fishers. That value may be the beluga sturgeon's doom. When preparing to spawn upriver, the beluga sturgeon is easy to capture, by harpoon or in nets. Even though it has been given limited legal protection in many areas, its numbers are decreasing everywhere that it lives. It is completely gone from several seas rivers in which it used to live, and scientists fear that it is critically endangered. In other words, it is very highly vulnerable to extinction across its entire range. Without further protection and enforcement of existing efforts, we may forever lose one of the biggest, most interesting fishes in the world. Thank you for watching. Hope you learned something about these amazing creatures. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. Thank you.